What is going on, folks? Session evolutionary biologist here, Samit Barai, and I want to take a moment here, right now, today, to debunk evolution as we know it. I don't think that evolution is even a thing, folks. It's all a big lie. All right, here's how it is, all right, folks. There's clearly some, you know, man-made evolution, and there's clearly some natural evolution, right? caused by, you know, genetic malfunctions and all this stuff here. You know, there's clearly a lot of things going on in the, in the melting pot of the, of the life forms and everything. And the fish, did they get legs on their own or did a meteorite land on Earth and add more uh, living elements to the Earth? Now, whenever you watch the Cosmos, the, uh, the series The Cosmos by Carl Sagan, or the remake, by Neil deGrasse Tyson. You know, they, they talk about single-celled organisms. They talk about, you know, we're, uh, here I am, sitting on the, the calendar of the Earth. You know, pretend the Earth, one Earth year is, is uh, you know, is, uh, is, the, the be is the whole time of, you know, age of the Earth. And here we are on the very edge of December 31st, and this is where life began. And, this is where this is where the single-celled organisms began, and do they really know the the connection between every life form? Come on, folks! There's a bunch of meteors, and there's a bunch of life on meteors, and they're just flying everywhere. There's uncountable number of Earth-like planets all over the multiverse, folks, and these meteors and meteorites and asteroids—they're just punching all over the planet, and they're dropping different life forms at us, all right, folks? And that's what's happening. Now, there's also evolution happening at a smaller scale, and there's probably evolution happening on the asteroids and meteors themselves, all right, folks? Men are from Mars, women are from Venus, not everything's from meteorites, folks. These are the rocks that move through the multiverse, and they spread life all around, folks. And that's how, that's how we are here today, folks. It's a combination of, of all kinds of, uh, you know, you call it evolutionary, you know, multiverse evolution through the meteors and ast asteroids. You have heard it here, folks. This is the real truth. This is the real science. This hypothesis will hold true, folks. And that's how it's done. The debunking of evolution as we know it. May Charles Darwin rest in very peacefully in his grave. He did some good work, but now the real work is done. I've pointed out the real truth about evolution, and I let the remaining scientists that we have today try to see if they can debunk this beautiful, master, masterful theory of mine. Thank you very much, folks. Thank you very much. Please stay tuned for future discoveries. Thank you so much. Thank you.